Hi, this is uh, Dom2E0WHQ. Just wanted to do a really, really quick video uh, on a uh, new uh, tablet which I have uh, just purchased. Literally just unwrapped it and, uh, and, and configured it. Um, it's a 8 inch Windows tablet. Yes, it runs Windows 10 on it. Um, <clears throat> let me just hold a ruler for you so you can see. So uh, get close enough to the screen. It is actually a uh, uh, an eight, eight inch tablet there, and this is running uh, Windows 10. The uh, the first thing I did with it because one of the reasons I got it was I wanted it to uh, to use uh, portable for running FT8. So. Um, uh, first thing I did was uh, install the drivers for my uh, Digimaster Pro 3, uh, which is my interface which I use um, between my radio and my computer. Absolutely su superb piece of kit, um, and uh, that's what I usually use. So I uh, installed the drivers for that. Um, just a single USB connection. Um, I'm just using a, a, an OTG conversion cable here, so um, that just plugs into standard USB and then it's micro USB at the tablet end. It actually has two micro USB sockets in it, so you can run a power pack and charge it while it's uh, being used. So, one of those little uh, handy power packs um, should give you enough power. Um, the, they say the battery should last about two hours. I'm not quite sure how long it uh, it, it will work uh, or it will last, but um, uh, we we shall see. Um, I've had it running for for a little while now, and uh, as you can see, the, uh, the the battery has gone down a little bit. Um, but yes, installed the drivers, loaded up WSJTX. Uh, onto it, which installed no problem at all. It's just like working on a uh, on a laptop. The uh, the spec of the tablet is it's got two two uh, gig of RAM and uh, I think the uh, solid state drive in it is uh, 64 gig if I remember correctly. But uh, yeah, running Windows 10 uh, uh, comes pre-installed. Uh, and it just seems to be running perfect. Uh, as I say, w WSJTX installed absolutely fine. And as you see, I've got it running in the background there. It's uh, decoding perfectly. And just scrolled off the screen was uh, my first QSO that I had on the uh, the tablet. Uh, but that's sending away. And um, yeah, so uh, there, there you go. There's my hand. That's how small it is. Eight, eight inches. Whoops. Just touch something on the screen there let me just get rid of that uh, there you go and uh, yep so uh, that's all hooked up uh, and it's currently hooked up to uh, uh, my icom ic7000 and there it is transmitting away and uh, and as you can see i've got uh, um, psk reporter running over here on a uh, on a laptop um, the laptop's not involved in any of this other than I wanted a larger screen just to show you PSK Reporter on it for the uh, the video. And uh, yep, uh, as you can see I'm certainly getting out okay, no problem at all there. So uh, the tablet came from China, it uh, was uh, around about £90 delivered, uh, which I thought was, uh, was fairly reasonable. Um, I haven't seen many tablets that are running um, Windows 10 and uh, this is going to be perfect for what I got it for which is exactly this it's when we're finally allowed out of lockdown um, I can take it on me when I go go out portable um, I love doing my QRP work and um, uh, my portable work as well and um, both USB uh, or uh, both sideband and, um, uh, and, and, uh, and FT8 as well um, so this will hook up quite nicely with uh, with my Icom 7000 which it's hooked up to at the moment and then uh, for ultralight when I go out to uh, portable it will hook into uh, uh, my uh, FT817 as well so it looks like I'll have a fairly good portable setup 
And as I say, while I've been doing the video, it's just been running there in the background. It looks like I'm about to have a, another QSO. Uh, so, uh, yep, just thought I wanted to uh, to post this video because uh, uh, I've seen lots of people who ask about what, uh, what the best setup is for going portable. And um, I, I saw this and I thought this, this was just going to be uh, ideal. Um, by the way, as you can see, I'm running the latest version of WSJTX, which, which is 2.3.0. Um, there's a few changes in it, but uh, it all seemed to load up okay. Uh, no problems at all. So uh, I'll probably just let that QSA finish there. And uh, hopefully some people found this interesting. I know that uh, there's probably a few people that uh, aren't great fans of FT8, but... Um, I think it's, this uh, this tablet will be absolutely fantastic for going out portable and working portable. Thanks for watching. Hope you found it interesting. This is Dom, uh, 2E0WHQ73.